For me, photography is a way to experience things in life I might never have had the opportunity had I chosen a different path. Many people work a bland job they detest going to every day just so they can take one vacation a year doing something they really want to do. My goal wasn't to make a living as a photographer by taking jobs that were more of a grind and less a pleasurable experience. I learned that lesson from watching other photographers that turned pro. They made good money but left each job stressed from working with unreasonable clients during the shoot and having to chase the money owed to them afterwards. My first priority was to always photograph subjects that make me happy because then I would always be happy. Making money was secondary and less important in the grand scheme as long as my photography was taking me to the places I wanted to go. And what a ride it's been. As a lifelong surfer, I wanted to travel around searching for that perfect wave. And photography gave me the opportunity to go to some great destinations in the Bahamas, Puerto Rico, Central America, California, and Hawaii, just to name a few. I'm a big fan of auto racing, starting with NASCAR, and I found a way to work with teams which gave me the credentials for unlimited access at all the tracks, and I found myself right in the middle of it all at Bristol and Indianapolis, Charlotte, and of course Daytona. For a while I was interested in offshore powerboat racing and I shot several races which netted me the opportunity to cover the Offshore Powerboat World Championships by shooting from a helicopter. On that particular shoot, I rode from Naples to Key West to shoot one day of the race weekend, then returned another day by plane to shoot from a chartered yacht. Spent that night in Key West and thanks to my client, I never spent a penny during the multi-day event. A lot of people worked very hard just so they could take their vacation time to travel to Key West for the offshore powerboat races and spending a lot of their hard-earned money to do it. Photography got me the best seat in the house and it didn't cost me anything to take it. Models are another subject I really enjoy working with. And over the years, I've had the chance to photograph some incredible talent. My favorite location to shoot is the beach. And once again, it's about the experience. Spending the afternoon with a fun model, picking out what she will wear, placing her in the right location to pose for an image that will conjure a fantasy to most that view it, while in that moment it's being created, it's my reality. One model I've worked with extensively is Julie Clark. I was her first photographer and got her interested in modeling when I had her pose with my friend's exotic cars. We did several photo shoots after that and eventually she caught the eye of Playboy and became Miss March 1991. Not long after that we drifted apart until Julie reached out to me in 2005 because she wanted some current pictures for her official website, which by the way is still up and running to this day. This particular video is a behind the scenes look at one of our photo shoots in 2005. Julie was 36 at that time and it had been 15 years since she posed for Playboy. So there I was, photographing a Playboy Playmate in a beautiful home 
on a waterway taking full advantage of the location using everything from the garage to the jacuzzi. All the garments and jewelry she wore for the shoot was my choice. The gold dress she wears is actually just a few yards of cloth I picked up at a fabric store, knowing I could wrap her with it and create something that would look like a very hot dress when I photographed it from certain angles. I think it worked well and was another part of the experience that I really enjoyed. Having the freedom to create an image using my choice of model, location, wardrobe, and time of day is invaluable in the creative process and rarely happens when tethered to a client's demands. Given the choice of working for a magazine with an unbearable art director, then waiting and pressing to get paid, or working with a playboy playmate in a waterfront mansion, getting wet in the pool and then watching the sunset before taking off for some dinner and drinks afterwards. You know what my pick would be, and if you still don't know why, here's a look at one of my many photo shoots with Julie Clark on a day that's just about as good as it gets for this photographer. <laughs>